What's going on, fellas? Well, uh, we got a little issue with the truck. Not a major issue. We have uh, amber light on. The mechanics are calling it a shadow code because when you turn these trucks on, DD13, DD15, you have to let the cycle go through as soon as that amber light turns off. Focus. Uh, as soon as that amber light turns off, you're supposed to uh, go ahead and crank it, but the driver hasn't been doing that, so I got the mechanic slash our son doing uh, the dyno with his uh, dyno computer, and this is his computer. You guys need to dyno your truck. Uh, send me an email. I will send you his hookup and uh, Hopefully you live around the area the Indian Empire area and uh, He'll come to you or you can come to him and Of course you're gonna pay to get the, the truck dyno, but You'll get some dyno going on uh, your truck and We have no reception here that freaking sucks so we gotta wait for the dyno computer to pick up some kind of reception. And then he's got that. It's all wireless. It is all wireless, it says. So we're just waiting and see what, uh... I'm pretty sure it's nothing. So we're gonna see, we're gonna see what, uh computer comes up with So far he's done uh, four tests on the truck, he's done the, the DEF system, the DEF pump, the injector, and right now he's doing the dyno on the turbo. So, it's pretty good the way he does the dyno, he just wants to make sure the whole truck is running perfect, and he was explaining to me that uh, if something is not married to another thing, then this dyno right here that is doing to it would marry everything so everything would be running in, in, pairs. Six, in pairs. But, uh, so is this a new program that you guys got going or? Yeah, this is a new one right now. This is like a prototype as of for right now. But it does all make some models. Engine after treatment systems, road speeds, electronic air dryer, um, filters, and stuff like that. Basically, anything that has to do with electronics that this thing can do. Any makes and models, any year. So, there you go, there you have it. Uh, Great Liners International Peterbilt's Max Bobos. He specializes on Max and Bobos, but this computer does all mates, all, all models. And the, the quality of it, it would be like a uh, dealer accessible. So whatever like a uh, Freightliner, Volvo, Mac, or anything can do, this thing pretty much does the same. The only thing it does not do is uh, software updates. But it runs all the same exact tests as dealers can do. So you heard it from the mechanic. So if you need your truck dyno, and you're getting jipped by Freightliner, or International, or Peterbilt, again, uh, send me an email. I'll send you his hookup and you guys can work out the numbers but so far like I said he's done uh, four tests on this truck it's a Freightliner with the DD13 uh, last week he did uh, <clears throat> our other Freightliner with the Series 60 engine and uh, so far so good everything's coming out good
So right now you're doing the test for the turbo, right? Yes. How's it look so far? Everything looks good. Temperature-wise, the turbo's boosting, how it's supposed to be boosting, rising up the DPF temperatures and stuff like that. So the turbo speeds are around 58,000, so it's about good. Good running turbo. It's a good truck, good truck. Uh, when we bought this truck, we took him to uh, do the inspection on the truck. So, not bad, not bad. But yeah, this is a new software that he's trying out for the company. And uh, so, how do you like the, the program? The computer. The computer so far is smooth, no glitching, no nothing, like stuff like that. I mean, it's pretty much accurate and on point. I have the full access dealer. Uh, tech tool for the Volvos and uh, Max and I go ahead and I pair this up with it compare it truck to truck running the same tests and pretty much reads and does the same thing that that one does on the Volvo Max side which and, one do you like better this one or theirs uh, I would I would want to say go go ahead and go with this one because uh, the one that we use on the laptops at the dealers they go ahead and they uh, freeze a lot and you got to restart your laptop and stuff multiple times a day and this one here you don't it's all wireless and stuff not that many wires in the way or anything like that and if it, if it the bluetooth didn't work i can also use a wire if i want to hardwire it in from the computer to the the qualcomm uh, interface so to me i want to say that this one I, I i would prefer this over anything really especially does i'll make some models all into one well there you guys have it there you guys have it uh as soon as he's done, I'll give you guys the results. But uh, pretty much all the tests that he's run on the truck, they came out with uh, passing grades, so it's a good thing. So another one passed. Oh, there you go, the turbo passed. DPF temperatures are all with inspects and stuff like that. These are all your inlet temperature readings. Your depth temperatures, the NOx conversions, and stuff like that. The sensors. Since he went ahead and replaced them already, this went ahead and already in, uh, entered it into the uh, ACM module, the after treatment control module. So everything's all matching and in order how it's supposed to be. Yeah. And everything's passed. <laughs> That's a good sign. That is a good sign. All right, fellas, again. Uh, if you need your truck dyno you need your truck worked on just uh, send me an email I'll leave my email down below on this video so you guys can get in touch with me and I'll get you in touch with them so the software on the truck just needs to need it to be updated yeah but this one doesn't do it that's the only thing this thing doesn't do though is updates transmission dyno mode
the region. Yeah, I was checking the hydrocarbon uh, module, the after treatment system, running the after treatment test. After treatment looks good though, because the temps are already rising up. Back pressure on the DPF is good as well. We are good to go right now. It's just going to do the dyno, I mean the region on it, just to make sure everything's running good on it. Again, uh, if you need your truck dyno, send me an email. I'll send you his uh, phone number Don't and uh, anything. <laughs> yeah, and uh, he, uh, he also does mechanic work, so. You guys uh, need to get your truck dying on, you need your truck uh, work on, send me an email, I'll send you a hook up and you guys can work out the numbers. You have to drive and drive safe, be safe, we'll see you guys on the next video.